God, I hope everything looks decent. I took like two minutes to make this. <laughs> Alright, let me actually get to the tile screen. And then we wait. Huh. Okay, I gotta pat myself on the back. This actually doesn't look half bad. <laughs> Probably too bright for Luigi's Mansion, but it doesn't look half bad. Sorry if someone's chatting right now, I'm, I'm doing something stupid. Oh my god. Stop with this chain of madness, thank you. <laughs> I'm a degenerate. Don't ask what I just did. Hi, I think I see I think I see people. Is it, are are you people? Are you real? Maybe. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Okay. Goddamn. So much typing that I probably should have done a while ago. I suppose I wait for some people to trickle in. I'm gonna take a moment to grab something to drink. Okay, it is, yeah. Alright, I think everything is perfect. Perfect. Alright. I'm gonna get this hell hole on the hole on the on the road hole. So the game sounds decent, and I don't have to worry about headphones in between my legs. And where did I put my charger? I have many chargers I actually need to work on. Doing it, undoing it, and doing it, and doing it well. Did it. Hi, Farf. Also, okay. Cool. Chat looks, cr chat layout looks crispy. Everything looks crispy right now. So, I should probably put this, like, somewhere around here. Like, I, th I feel like I've gushed enough on the social media about the changes made to this version of the Hidden Mansion to kind of give a reason why this, hit this version of the Hidden Mansion is terrifying. <sighs> Hidden Mansion file. No, I'm not I'm not I'm not anticipating this whatsoever. I'm not gonna be happy about this. Huh? It'll be fine. Oh yeah, it'll be perfect fun, you know. Ghosts do more damage, have more attacks, drop more poison mushrooms, have more health. You do the same amount of damage. Yeah, it'll be fine. <laughs> it'll be fine. I'm terrified. I smell honey. Wait, what? <laughs> And that begins already. Fantastic. Also, I'm going to be meticulous because apparently, uh, one apparently, in order to get the there's now an S ranking in this. In order to get that, you basically have to perfect the mansion, for collection wise. It's great. It's fantastic. It makes me worry for my future safety. Also, just uh, mention that I'm planning on cannibalizing this footage for a video later on. Yeah. 
Yeah, yellow ghosts have 15 health. That's okay. And they drop poison mushrooms. God damn it, stop that. <laughs> I, I, what? This is the first room? No, bad day. Uh, oh god, run! Okay, this is gonna take some time to get used to, and also do decent with. Hit. Come here, come here, come here. Hit. So. Just for comparison's sake, by the way, I want to draw a comparison. So that room that just happened. So we had a yellow, a pink, and a blue ghost. Mm -hmm. Blue ghost you don't even see to like area three or later. This room was normally just three yellow ghosts. I think this paints a picture. <laughs> a beautiful one. A terrifying one. It's like the screamer. Oh, also want to remind. I also want to remind. Remind. No health. No health drops. There are no health drops. The only way to get health back is to go back to Egad's lab. Does it? Hmm. And the mice are here. I forgot about that part. Damn. Uh took so much damage. Oh, that's a speedy spirit. That's a speedy spirit. That's a speedy spirit. Oh my god. Oh my god, I deal I take double damage. I thought my friend was just kidding about this. Oh my god! What the hell's going on? <laughs> Holy shit! I want that speed spirit though. Uh, tight court. I'm gonna die in the first room, I can already tell. Especially if we keep walking over these mice! Le let go? Okay, dead. Dead. <laughs> no fucking way! Like, actually, no fucking way! Oh my god! Holy shit! Dude! <laughs> oh. No, this is going to be a multi-stream endeavor. I don't even know if I'll go for the whole 100% anymore. It's just, this is a multi-stream endeavor now. Just by this, what, by, just by this 10 minute snippet alone, this has cemented the entirety of this game now for this part is it's gonna take balls loads of time and suddenly there's money in here. There's some money over here. Money randomized? Oh good god, I hope money's not randomized. Also, 
I mean, I don't know if there's people lurking. Cool, if you're lurking, I don't care, but... Like, I hope, like, this layout looks decent enough. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna have you leave me alone for just half a minute. While I pop this. There's some money over here. Yeah, that's why I might actually make it uh, be an advocate of saving between rooms. Run! That was a terrifying sound effect. I think the game broke a little bit right there. <sighs> hey, that's nice and all, but I want to go over here. Technically, you know, technically, I could cheat and break out the Luigi amiibo. Or Oh, God, I should clean this. I could break out the Luigi amiibo or the Toad amiibo and use this little amiibo platform, slap that sucker around there and heal, but uh, I'm gonna go for the full challenge. Gama Sabu. Look, did I ever claim to be good at Luigi's Mansion? Look, did I ever claim to be good at this new form of Luigi's Mansion? <laughs> you can go look through my Twitter archives. I'm pretty sure m whenever I mentioned this on Twitter, I was like, oh, It's harder! And that's uh, that's the exact noise that came out of me. The, the exact noise. Mouse, go away. Okay, still a speedy spirit in there. I'm gonna let you go. Yeah, do you see the mouses? Like the how they self right. Like, the mouse is like, stop, look for you, and self-right. I'm just trying to avoid him. Don't you- Oh, I lost the speed spirit. Okay, you know what, that's fine. No, they never stop spawning. Oh god, run! Like, I'll make an effort to get a speedy spirit, but I won't- I don't think I'm gonna go for 100% this time around. <laughs> hey! Reminder, I'm already at 44 health. I think this- this play- I think my, this first playthrough of this game is just gonna be to learn the intricacies of Hand Mansion. I went for the flash. Go, 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 go. Oh god, what's happening to the audio? The audio just lost its mind. <sighs> Mario, you're on your own. I don't like these. I'm going home. Back at these. Oh, it's a little bit too big. Dang it. Hold on, I'm going to fix the chat a little bit. Sorry. Way to go far if you moderately broke the chat. Hmm. Thanks for testing it for me, though. It's 
It might be, but keep in mind, Luigi's Mansion, like, Luigi's uh, scared. Luigi's a scared, by the way. <laughs> Luigi's whole aesthetic is that he is scared. So any little thing causes him to freak out, and that's what's part of the original difficulty. So in this, they kept that, but they added in more people. Hi, Nera. Hey, Nera. Oh, boy, Nera. <laughs> oh, boy. But yeah, it's definitely like they just throw a ton more stuff at you, but they keep on ramping it up. It's kind of like how they did uh, Master Mode for Breath of the Wild, is whatever you're dealing with at the end of the game for, for Breath of the Wild, Master Mode puts that at the start of the game. And this is, seems to be no different. Huzzah! Yeah. Oh, aren't you clever? Oh god, the auto compression is having an issue. Bop this quick. Okay. Really? No, that's not cool! Oh my god, I love it. I hate it and I love it at the same time. Did you catch that, by the way? It's the mirror only ghost, but the mirror, but the only mirror is that tiny ass mirror in the back of the room. Oh, oh, they are smart. I love them. They're smart. Oh, oh, I've been, I've been grabbed by the ghoulies. Oh, he's down here. Oh, he was up here. Dang it. Hey, just a gentle reminder. Room three of the game. Look at what my health. <laughs> okay, I want to hit this. Thank you. <sighs> it's going to be a long night. Oh, it's going to be a long night. <laughs> I'll find him. Oh, my kidneys. Oh, that's hard. Oh, my God. I don't... What? When did I say awkward? Sorry, I've been having this, like, string of events recently where, like, I'll say something and then I'll totally forget what the hell I just said. Okay, so that's the thing. So the mansion does black out like it always does. Hey, do you know those things called elemental ghosts? Yeah, they spawn during the blackout. Random elements too, not the same one either. And three is no longer the cap. Five is no longer the cap during the blackout. Listen, like Grezzo, and I believe Grezzo also made Dark Moon. Grezzo was like, hey, you know what? You know what? People like difficulty. Let's just butt fuck the game and make it difficult. As I'm, ho I'm holding Dark Moon, sorry. I should I should probably have like turned it around or something. You can't, you can't even see because it's so far away. Okay, I guess you can kind of see Luigi scared shitless. <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna just gather a few coins.
Book. Attack of the books. Now I, I'm just curious if the mouth, if the, uh, if the cheese is still here. The cheese is still here. Got him. Hi, Te Rune Tempest. You reminded me that I actually wanted to update my uh, notification sound effects, make that one a little bit, a little bit shorter. <sighs> I'm gonna die to this guy. You watch. Hi, Portrait Ghost with 150 health. Why? And I still got the perfect. Oh, I, I had a sorry. I had a moment of download. I think I've now learned how to properly suck up in this game. Too bad I didn't realize that for the. Hey, guess what? Project of this game I did. I actually did record a project on this. <laughs> Anyway, let, let me go. Let me go ahead and read a book. But yeah, this is. I don't know if there's actually achievements in this game, if you'd believe it. I was real master drawing the cheese in the dark. They shine gold with contentment. I must try. C Parmesan. Nice. Wow. He gets heartless. So, by the way, I took... I want to note, I was panicking, panicking, panicking this whole time. Took zero damage and had a perfect cycle of the ghosts if I go like when I turn in all these ghosts and I go see uh, and I go see Egad after afterwards I'll be able to show that hey there are there is actually a new ranking a platinum ranking platinum rank it basically means you took no damage you never broke the line and, and you and you perfectly captured the ghost. <laughs> By the way, they pull harder. By the way, they have 150 health. Uh, mouse, I almost stepped on it. Mouse, I almost stepped. On it. I'm like trying to re make sure I don't miss anything in the chat. Sorry, I'm like hella distracted. That was the rule for gold. Far if it's we now have we now have platinum. <laughs> it's like bayonetta, pure platinum. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Let me pull the covers off the bed. Come here, you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now you now you're here. Damn. Okay, I keep I keep looking for cheese because I'm terrified. Oh, why are you in here? I missed it. <sighs> Whatever. I'm not going for perfect right now, anyway. And I broke this the line. <laughs> Let me gather up the pearls. So that's gonna give me a goal, uh, at least a goal in her.
None of the crew have shown up. Can you clarify by crew? Because I'm confused what you mean by that. Done. Oh. Four health! You know what? I'll take that. I lost four health. That's fine. I'm going... <laughs> I'm going to go fight the boss now with 50% with, with health. Pray. <laughs> Side note. Of all the things in the game, that is probably the creepiest. Just Babo. Wee! <laughs> Please no. He was born as a he was born a ghost, you know. <laughs> Ugh. Like I can go to the gallery and show you it if you really want to see it, but Chauncey Chauncey, one year old. He was born a ghost. <laughs> Fucking logic, dude. Does it actually? Let's test this theory, by the way. I gotta see if this theory actually does work. If I do reset my health by going back to Egad's lab, because I would like to do this fight with more health. Um, on the flip side, well, flip side. I would like to take this time to mention that from what I have been told and seen, well, read, I should say, is especially boss ghosts have new attacks or variations to the attacks that make them harder. Also, I'm going to read something really quick here. Okay, it, it, it does full heal me. I thought I was just shooting smoke there for a minute. Also, I know I've, I'm pretty, I'm not even certain I did already say this. Also, is that the door? That is the door. I'm not even sure I did say this already, but unfortunately, all of this is going to be covered up by an overlay. I am planning on cannibalizing a majority of this footage to do one or two bonus videos for a Luigi this a project of on this game. So make me say stupid stuff and you can and I can probably include like the original VOD. Okay, nothing there. Yep, that's still poison mushroom. L look, welcome to bonus game far. Welcome to bonus stage. Everyone cowers in fear. Mario. All right, let's stop. Let's stop horsing around and start horsing around. He's okay. There he is. I was about to say, wait, why is he just floating above his bed? Hi, Chauncey. Not really. Uh. Okay. Uh, oops. Okay. Uh, I missed. Hold on. Getting the aim on this is a little rough. Uh. Could you not, like, big boy punch me, please? Thank you.
Give me now. Just want to play. I hate grown-ups. And here's the part. And here's the part where it continues. Like this whole part with Chauncey is like the creepiest part of the game, unless you have like a fear of the dark, or like very specific things that you have uh, like a phobia of. Small, not grow smaller. Small, itty tiny, tiny, little wee. Goo 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 goo. <laughs> not okay with this. Still not okay with this. <laughs> Definitely not okay with this. Big boy punch. Oh, they're bigger. Oh god, they are bigger. Ah! Oh, what the fuck? No. No, no, no. Oh, okay. They come from behind. Okay. This is fine. <laughs> okay, we're fine. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, this is not okay. I'm actually not okay. Oh god. Oh god, he's booking. He is he's booking. <laughs> I love it. I hate it and I love it at the same time. <laughs> How do you help? Are you the bait? <laughs> Balls. Balls in your face, you say. Balls in my face, you say. Give me ball. Like, I'm, okay, as dumb as it sounds, like, I am just, like, a little misty-eyed because of how ter- like, how terrifyingly rough they up the, the ante on this boss fight. Ah! What the shit spot? No! No, no, no! Not okay! There's two, there's two. Oh! <laughs> Balls in your face, you say. Oh, ow. Get in here. Thank you. I didn't die. Uh, that's a victory. I didn't die. And now to die of the mushroom. <laughs> I hate that they put poison mushrooms every place there's hearts. Oh, you don't realize like how much this fills me with joy and dread at the same time. I love hate it. Okay. Pardon my language here. But this game but this but the hidden mansion, it's like a hate fuck. I think I, I think that illustrates the point. I'm going to keep going and, and just drop, go past that now. Uh, going back to the lab again. You messed up. God, that was actually a really good song back in the day. Hey gamers. Hi gamer. Happy Halloween. Happy Hollow Spook. I'm playing Mickey Speedway. Please tell me you're at least you at least are finding like a spooky map to play on. No. Wow. Not well, even the deep south, the spookiest place we know. Uh, well actually that's a lie, because <laughs> What I'm doing is I'm getting the last platinum trophies on the two hardest Grand Prix. 
and they're pretty fucking hard. Including the hardest track in any racing game ever, Oregon. Oregon, by the way. Oregon, by the way. Either way. Look, we both uh, know what we're saying. Should I be duck or mouse? You should be small brother duck. Small brother duck? Louie. Man, the nephews are broken, though. Damn it. <laughs> I came to the realization yesterday that this game has 10 playable characters and 6 of them are ducks. They got silver on Chauncey. That's the platinum portrait. Anyway, your options are Donald Duck or Mickey Mouse because I want to play a balance. Oh, damn it. I was about to say we'll play Goofy because I play Goofy, but okay. Uh, fuck, I play Mickey. Okay. Oh boy! Hot boy! Anyway. <laughs> oh, right. I have to set it. I just figure this is a, doing this is a great way to just mindlessly kill time while talking to someone. Yeah. Because it's hard, but it's not, like, hard enough where I have to, like, devote brain power to it. Okay. Negative coins. Oh, I don't want that shit. Ooh. Oh, they e oh my goodness, I love it. Bless. Wait a minute. Bless this game. It even has a score attack of some sort. What is Tiny Racers? Hold on. Hold on. Holding on. Pulling back. Reverse. Can't reverse. Reverse. Reverse gear gone. So now I gotta go see this platinum portrait. Hold on. I, I at least have one of these platinum portraits. Did I just discover something new about this game I've had since I was a child? All right, he's gonna be on the first floor. Okay, so the All game right. shows your best ranking picture. Let's see this. Oh my god! We're tiny. That's great. We're, are we toony? Are we also a little loony? Mm -hmm. God damn! Yeah, there, there yeah. it is. Platinum photos that it looks fu they look oh, fucking it's amazing. Horrible. I love how you said something horrible about your end. I'm like, god damn, they actually spent time making new art and really good looking art for the new uh, rank on ghosts. Yeah, because you get platinum, right? Yeah, you can get platinum. Basically, you never break the line. You and you one cycle or you one cycle them and never take damage in the process. Okay, I'm turning off tiny racers. This is horrible. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm, I am messing around the lab a little bit too long. Let's get back to the mansion. But yeah, anyway, achievables. Oh, I'm about to get that one. And God damn it, Elsa. Okay, so we might go for that. Also, I don't know how long, like, I guess I pose this to chat as well, not just ceiling because he is here and also happens to have game in question, but I would not object to either, depending on how nerd population in call, to changing things up to uh, Lethal League Blaze or doing the 100% Orange Juice Halloween event for a little bit tonight too. Okay, uh, I have to eat dinner at some point. Well, that's fine. I'm... So the, we'll the latest I'm going is 11. I took a I took a big old snoozer for a good two hours, so I'm recharged. Big old snoozer, by the way. Also debating if I if I'm even gonna bother going into work tomorrow because a my birthday's on, on Saturday and I don't feel like I need the extra money right now. <laughs> It's very bad form to call out the day after a holiday. But I didn't go to a party. Okay. It's still bad form because your boss is going to assume you went to a party. This is true. Because also, why I else would someone call out the day after a holiday besides, bro, I went too hard, I'm too hungover to work. Um. <laughs> Take that, Pete. <laughs> just... Take that, Pete. Mickey, why are you such an asshole? <laughs> I can't do the I can't do a Pete voice, surprisingly enough. Man. 
I just I fucking love this game, dude. I know no, it's, it's a like good a game. Movie. I've said before to you multiple times, it's a good game. I'm upset because Cayman was over here once. He's like, "All right, I want to see this game," and then I played multiplayer for like the first time ever in this game, and I'm like, "Oh, multiplayer in this game is kind of whack." It sounds like it's well, just a at really... least two players kind of whack. It's probably fine if you have four players. I suppose this was a long time ago, so you couldn't have like AI. Holy God! Oh my God! So many grabbers in the bathroom. Plus, it's like, you know, it does the Mario Kart 64 thing, where it can't handle having four characters, four players, and the music at the same time or something. Uh-oh. And, like, the music is, like, one of the best things about this game. I missed. <laughs> 50 health already, by the way. <laughs> Oh my god, they, they, they comboed me. Okay, I cleared Yellowstone Park. They actually comboed me. You can't hit me if my back's against the wall. Honestly, the best part about this game is the music. Okay, the second best part of this game is the music. The best part of this game is all the dumb Disney characters talking all the time. <laughs> There's nothing like just minding your own business and then you just hear... Uh, he's just here. Sorry about that, Mini! Oh, yeah. I got one. Funny. <laughs> yeah, that, that is, like, the best part. Especially because there's so few characters, like, they can actually have, like, quote-unquote intimate relations in that. That's not the right, that's not the best word choice. That was a very, just crazy. Yes, that was a poor word choice, but you know what I mean. Especially with Pete, because everyone fucking hates Pete. Like, I, nev I never played as Pete, but I can only imagine how terrible it is. Just, just, you know, it's like, uh, you'll get yours, duck! Happy Palooka! It's funny. Oh, I got Hydro Plane. Also, I'm gonna go heal, save, because I lost almost 80 health in the, fr in the bathroom save. with the grabbers. <laughs> Oh my. Please don't grab don't use the grabbers in the bathroom. Oh my god, there are bomb ghosts in the, on the first floor. So how far are you in your hidden mansion run? Uh, I I'm mansion. short I'm shortly after Chauncey and I just did the uh, bathroom. That you basically how you get the first key to area two. In the bathroom. Let's like I know you're not gonna buy the game, so you don't have to yell at me I'm not buying the game. I just want to tell you that, you know, the first room of the game in the normal mansion, it's three yellow ghosts, right? Yeah. How about a yellow ghost followed by a pink ghost followed by a blue smasher? Oof. Oh, by the way, they have they have 150% normal health. Oof. Well, that doesn't matter. It does when you don't deal double damage like you did in the original release. Although, I guess, I'm assuming this is on your recording 3DS, so you don't have the, uh, scene up on the new one. So it makes catching ghosts harder. Oh, no. It, well, it's a little bit like you can, uh, it uses gyro controls for stuff. So, like, you can hold B, like, if you're sucking at something, you can hold B and it'll, like, act like you're using a, a pseudo C-stick in conjunction with the normal control style. And then to aim up and down, use gyros. Welcome back, Nera. I don't know how long you were gone, but I lost 80 health to the to the uh, first room of area two. There you go, Pete. I'll get you, Mickey. I can't fucking do it with Pete voice. I'm mad. Fuck. I love this game, dude. Oh, right. The fish are in every room now too. I forgot. Yeah, while you guys were playing Orange Juice on Monday, uh, I was just suffering through a uh, frantic finale. Because, like, maybe, you know, maybe I should get all the Platinums in this game. 
and then I did get all the platinum, and it took a while. It took so many tries. Oh god. Ugh. And then I learned that there's a mirror mode in this game. And of course there is. Because all good kart racers getting... have a mirror mode after you beat the main mode. <laughs> so I'm main mode, by the way. getting platinums in the mirror mode now. That's Washington, D.C. done. Okay, if I suck up this fish, will they stop spawning? In a perfect they do. world, I move my N64 over so I could just stream it while I'm just chatting. But then, don't be like... Like, I don't care what you do, really dude. Finicky. Like, I mean, I will tell you right now that I do plan on cannibalizing this footage for a bonus video or two, but I don't care what you do. I just don't want to move my N64 because if I do, it might stop reading the game cartridge for like an hour again, like it did yesterday. Wait, it stopped reading the game cart? Well, you know how the N64 is, where like every time you change cartridges, you have to like super change cartridges. Yeah, I guess. Or like every time you take it out, it might register to the thing. It could be that just my N64 is old and dirty, so it's harder, but. Oh god. Anyway, I'm I'm handling the dancing couple right now. <laughs> oh god, I'm trapped in the corner of the poison mushroom. Or dismiss, send in the dancing lobsters. I wish it was the dancing lobsters, it's probably much more enjoyable. Hey, I got a platinum on them. It's pizza. It's better. This is nice. <laughs> Okay, Nara, you're not allowed to leave the room. Every time you leave the room, I stop getting platinums. <laughs> I don't care if you have to pee in 10 minutes. You have to stay. Fuck. I wonder if the guy who composed for this game did any other games. Because it's not the usual Rareware guy who did the comp um, composition for this game. Uh, oh right, you're talking about that game. You s that game is done by Rare, correct? Because I know you just said yeah, it. Yeah, but... it is. Okay. You gotta use, you gotta use the bomb. Uh, what the? Crazy. No! That there's trash crazy. ghosts! There's Okay, there's trash ghosts in here. Why is there trash ghosts in, this, in the back room? Anyway, now I just have to not lose my brain in Malibu. It shouldn't be too hard. It'll be hard if you have to, you know, you know, drink Malibu. I, I tried. You know, I tried something, and I don't think we, I don't think anybody can appreciate what I tried. What the? Thank you. Thanks, game. M small, help. Oh, hi, Blazekin. Um, dumpster ghost, dumpster ghost, piss off! Oh, you're gonna drag me right over your banana peel, aren't you? Yep. That feel when you get Are Mario Karted. Are they green gobblers? I thought I've been calling them dumpster ghosts this whole time. Well, Accurate. I, you know, I, I think that's their official name, but you know, don't say it. that anywhere in the game. So. I also just like calling them green gobblers because it sounds like green goblin. <sighs> it's you who's out, Gobby. Out of your mind! I am out of my mind, thank you. Okay, let's spawn the other one. I'm gonna get them both at once. I went too fast somehow! I just don't know the optimal path to use the dogs section. Oops. Probably not running into the dogs. 
Oh, don't worry about being late. Oh my god, there's still more in this room? No! I didn't save. This game has no right to have as good music as it does, to be honest. There's so many games that have music that, no, that music as good as it does, that it does, if that makes any sense. Oh god! How did I not trip up there? Today's a chaser. Wow, that's smart. <laughs> Come here, you cockamamie bitch! It's a miracle I haven't taken any more damage than I have. No, no nanners on the floor. I forbid it. It is verboten. Man, the sound is freaking out in this, in this. Help it. Yes, it is Verbolton. Verbolton, oh, it's a D sound. <sighs> Son of a gun. Wow. That didn't take nearly as long as I thought it would. Oh, I guess Mickey is just better than Donald. He has I a... I tried it with Donald yesterday and it didn't work. Listen, he has protagonist privilege. <laughs> and a touch. Just, well, that's, uh, victory vehicles done. Which means there's only one more platinum in the game left, and it's mirror mode, frantic finale, which I'm pretty sure is just literal hell. Let's, uh, what's a lot of puss? Because I don't know if in your video you got to Frantic Finale. Probably not. Oh, no, no, no. If you unlock Frantic Finale, you have to do some fucking bullshit. No, 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 no. I think in that video, I think the furthest I got was... Did I start, get like halfway through the second Grand Prix? I don't remember. I see. Yeah, uh, okay, so concepts. Uh, in order to unlock the fifth Grand Prix, you have to get, you have to win all four Grand Prix, and also you have to do the scavenger hunt across all four Grand Prix. Scavenger hunts in a racing game, by the way. Diddy Kong Racing, by the way. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, I know I said that the nephews were cheap, but I want to play Louie for this because I don't know. Actually, actually, I'm gonna play uh, Huey because frantic finale is hell. Uh. Alright, secret function, boo radar, yada yada. I'm ready for chat and just be like, what the fuck is this idiot talking about? Listen, you mentioned that I made a video on it, and and I've said it be you've said it before, and I re and I repeat, I parrot back everything you say about it. Disney, Disney Speedway USA, good game. It's Mickey Speedway, not Disney Speedway. Okay, Di Mickey Speedway, still, point stands, good game. <laughs> Objectively good game, unlike Disney's Party, which I think is a good game, but understand that people that understand objectively that it's not a good game. I'm like I'm the same way with, well, Sonic games are an easy punch to throw, but Sonic R and Sonic Unleashed. Sonic R is a good game. Okay. Sonic R, good game. Sonic Unleashed, good game. Some people will say otherwise, but I say good game. That's interesting collision. Okay. A lot of people hate Sonic Unleashed because the frame drops and I the mean, fact there's no drop shadows. My my uh, hashtag unpopular opinion oh, yeah. is that the Wii version of Unleashed is better than the 360 version. Oh yeah. By the way, chat. That boo normally has only 30 health. 45 health. <laughs> oh fuck. God, I am so not ready for frantic finale backwards. Oh god. 
The worst part about Mirror Mode is like because you get you are so conditioned to play a racing game, you like have the route memorized so you can focus on what's okay, around the you. Okay, the thing with Frantic Finale is I literally didn't know this GP existed until after I bought this game at Magfest this year. The GP, the Game Boy Color version, right? No, the N64 version. There was just a whole Grand Prix I never found as a kid because okay. I didn't do the stupid scavenger hunt because you know. You're a kid. I was a dumb kid. Everybody's a dumb kid at one point. But it's like, what the fuck is this? Okay, but like, okay, but I'm talking with Nero now, by the way. Um, mm -hmm. I, I do admit, like, even though Sonic Unleashed, Sonic Unleashed is my favorite Sonic game. Still. Oh, yeah. I will admit the metal hunting is the stupidest thing that could have possibly done in that game for the PS3 and 360 versions. It's a bad, it was a bad idea. I also, the lack oh, of drop shadow was a bad idea. Just hurts my eyes. I, I actually like cannot look at footage of Sonic Unleashed without getting a headache. Uh, on the Wii or on? On the 360. Fair enough, because it has terrible frame rate. Well, that's not even it. I just, it just looks hideous. Okay. Again, it might just be because like the colors aren't as obtrusive in the Wii or the Wii version because they're flatter and less interesting. Oh, yeah. Nice double bait, my guy. Want to play Game Boy Advance? But. But, like, guys, even in lieu of the fact that it has terrible frame rate at times, it has metal stuff and all that jazz, I love Sonic Unleashed. All parts of Sonic Unleashed. Opinion alert. How dare you have opinions on things? Like, I... I have... I guess the correct... I guess a, good, a term to use would be, like, an, Achille, uh, an Achilles heel. I have an Achilles heel when it comes to beat-em-ups. If it's a beat-em-up... There's a really good chance I'm going to love it, regardless of how bad it is seen publicly. The word publicly. you're looking for is soft spot. There you go. Well, that's also an Achilles heel. <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll stop. I'll stop. Mm -hmm. I guess it is when you think about it. Because that was like the only way that Achilles could be taken down was his heel, a.k.a. his soft spot. Really? So the desk? I think there's a difference between a weak spot and a soft spot, though. Also, oh, there's some money over here. Man, I love this game, but Frantic Finale could go to hell. That's how most people feel about I'm trying to think of a racing game. Sorry, I am trying to think of another racing game off the top of my head. I it's mean, most people don't like Rainbow Road. Rainbow Road is, especially in the Wii version of. Okay, he clipped out of existence. Like, especially like the Wii Rainbow Road. Like, there's only two, there's only like ten people who like it, and it's the assholes who play who play the custom tracks that are hard, that are considered Rainbow Road easy. I mean, the Wii Rainbow Road isn't even hard. Okay, it's not when you understand it, but okay. The only let... difficult Rainbow Road game, or the only Rainbow Road game in the series is Eights. Eights Rainbow Road is. Well, it's mainly on 200. Mainly on 200. I have problems with that on 150 even. But yeah, it's mainly 200. Oh god, I've never seen Huey's portrait before. That's hideous. Whatever. Alright, Hawaii's done. Waikiki? Step, uh, just the first level of hell has been defeated. So you're oh. getting good. Now I'm in Oregon, which is just literal hell. Listen, just because it's the next state over from you. <laughs> no, the fact that it's the next state over makes it worse. Because it's like, you know. <laughs> like, you have to play this track so perfectly. For, like, no goddamn reason. Oh, I just fucked up. Mirror mode! 
You know what? Here's the part I'm gonna have to tell. I'm gonna tell you that's gonna make you like mildly upset. Mm -hmm. You probably have to scavenger hut in that to find some arbitrary bullshit for one last little secret. No, nope, I have everything confirmed. The game told me so. I have every track unlocked. Mom said. <laughs> Just God said so. What if God There's said? There's not even anything to unlock from getting uh, the, all the platinums besides more dumb cheats. Oh God, I really. <sighs> I really don't want to do this in mirror mode. It's hard enough on its own. You know what, Nero? That's funny. Like, you point that out. And I think I made that... I think I made that lewd-ass joke the first time I played through Luigi's Mansion. Like, way long ago when it was the GameCube version of the game. When I recorded the 3DS project, no mention of how lewd it is. Or the fact Luigi's humping furniture to find things. Really? That was like the hee hee funny meme that like every video gaming YouTuber who played the game did. Yeah, I didn't do it for the 3DS version. I guess either my vocab- my lexicon. There we go. My lexicon has gotten more mature or I just completely forgot. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. It's Bulala. You know, like ooh la la from that dead game. Oh. I guarantee you, I have like one of three people who know what you're talking about. <laughs> you know, I know how I even know about that. Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing. Secondly, demo disc. <laughs> hey, that's funny. I had. Well, I do technically have a Dreamcast again, but I had a Dreamcast when it first came out, and it and. Like when I got the time, it was a, there was a demo disc for it, and Space Channel Five was on there, and I didn't understand the concept of ooh rhythm, despite the fact I was in choir and band at that time. I said he ain't got rhythm, no he ain't got rhythm, he ain't got rhythm. I ain't Sorry. got rhyme either. Damn the it. uh, the beat of this song is distracting me from the bit of doing. And also, I hate this track. L listen, Nera, like, you know the exact same person. Go right, thank you. You know the exact same person. In fact, you're using his icon. You're still using his his uh, emotes right now. I guarantee you, for one reason, Lee fucking loves Space Channel 5. I hear it's a good game. Oh, it's a good game. It's, but it's basically Simon Says to a rhythm, but it's a good game. I mean, that's what all rhythm games are at their core. No, I mean, like, you've probably have seen footage at some point. It's literally no. your your fight with an enemy is them going left, right, choo, choo, and then you parrot that back. Hmm. Sounds like Parappa the Rapper. Is it? I've never played Parappa. Mm -hmm. I haven't either, but I've seen footage, and that's what it looks like. Do you know why we stopped the car? <laughs> Man, Oregon is hell. And you and you visit there weekly. Got I never actually been to Oregon. Really? Nope. Never had a reason to. Yeah. Oh, right. There's yeah. like genuinely no reason to go to Oregon if you live in Washington. Oregon is like it's like Washington, but the hippies have less money. <laughs> That's literally Oregon. Okay, fair enough. Cool joke. <laughs> That's actually the fun. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go on Amazon. No offense to anyone who lives in Portland, by the way. Also, Toad flushed the key. Yeah, right. he does that. Also, I'm gonna go to Amazon. And I'm going to look it up, because if I can find... I probably won't find the original version, but... I want to see how much it would make me cry... If... If Skies of Arcadia was something less than, like, $300. Ugh. The cheapest one... Uh, the cheapest one I'm seeing is, uh, 130 That's definitely a GameCube game. Skies of Arcadia Legends... Is a GameCube game. I don't know if it's the same game. 
or if it's like a uh, remaster. Oh, you know, it's just that any any game from that console generation is just in Amazon hell. Right. I'm, told, I'm trying to shake the toilet to get the key out of it that you threw down in there because you're a clumsy elf. God damn it! I'm fine. I fucking hate this! I think Ceiling okay, hates Oregon. So this is, okay, I'm going to give you the lowdown on why Oregon is the hardest track in the game. Alright? Okay, so first of all, the entire track is like tiny path with momentum killer, like, you know, like bad terrain on like either side of the tiny path for like the whole way through and it's pretty much all turns you need to drift through right okay well it's the hardest then, thing so go keep going then you go into this tunnel and then when you come out of this tunnel you immediately drop onto a tiny bridge you cannot see the bridge until you are in the air and you have to land on it so basically, you have to hope your trajectory is true before you even get off your jump. I mean, you have a bit of time to like adjust your momentum, but if your angle is off, then you just immediately drop into the water. And then you're not out of hell yet, because the bridge is narrow, and you're surrounded by water, and it also is twisty turning. And then if you survive that, you're done. But you have to do that three times without fucking up. And it's like, not fun. It's not fun. Um... Easily the hardest track in any racing game I've ever played. I was gonna mention something. I forget what I was gonna say. Mm -hmm. A seer of dropped items, Madame Clairvoya, which apparently she is, doesn't have like buck teeth. It's just a freaking handkerchief. I would, uh, I would like 15 uh, years uh, thinking uh, that she just had a big, big ass pair of lips and buck teeth with holes in them. I genuinely have no idea what you're talking about. Madame Clairvoya. I, I know who Madame Clairvoya is. Like, I never once in my life thought she had buck teeth. Like her handkerchief she has on her, it has an eye on it, basically like a Sheikah eye. But because like the low resolution of the GameCube version, I thought she just had big ass lips, four buck, four buck teeth with a, with a big ass gap in it, bigger than Mike Tyson's. I actually made it onto the bridge that time. Oh well. Um. I'm gonna try not to get super mad, but it's difficult. Also, also one more thing. Uh, it's hell. It's hell. It's actually Welcome hell. To hell. <laughs> Welcome to hell. Welcome to hell. I got a I got a uh, lifetime membership. It doesn't help that this track also has the worst song in the entire game. Okay, get up here. Run around, run around, run around. Turn. Just I missed one. How'd I miss one? Qualities. Also, the white ghosts deal damage now instead of just the red ones. For grabbers. Okay, just come over here. Oh, I missed! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it. Oh, so I see you're, you've decided to bully Daisy as mini gotcha. Nope, still playing as uh, Huey. Oh, Shazbot! We did it, we did it, guys. We completed a lap. But are you but are you hating the track more? Oh, it's done. I actually don't think I can hate this track any more than I do currently. So, because one more thing, I think you're, you're still like a new viewer. So I want you to note that how much damage I took. How much damage I took. In the normal mansion, that would have been like... Eight, I would have had like 80 health. Maybe 82. Game's hell. Game is now hell. It is actually literal game hell. Game is hard. Like, they found a way to make the game hard. Shit. <laughs> Which should be fair. Isn't that like the point? They... I hope that's not aiming at me. Okay, good. 
But yeah, um, like one more thing, you'll see you'll see more accurately what's coming up here, like the hot amount of BS they got. But basically, running things over again, all ghosts have 150% their normal health. You deal the same amount of damage. You take more damage. And the cap for, of ghosts in a room is removed or capped at 8 instead of 3 or 5. Basically, it sucks. I wish I could delete Daisy from this game. She's like the only voice I hate listening to. Let's... Like... Okay, I'm gonna make somebody upset, but can we be fair? There's not a lot of people who like Daisy. Period. Daisy Duck specifically, by the way. Yes. Not the character in Smash. And not the... Oh, can you imagine if Daisy Duck was in Smash Brothers? Just no other Disney characters. Just, just Daisy, Daisy Duck. Duck. Yeah. And, like, they call... And You know what would be the biggest kick in the pants? They, they say that she's the rep for Kingdom Hearts. Oh, you took that one step further into hell. Look, I have a gift. Ooh. Yeah, it's just super annoying because her stock voice clip for getting into first place is what a great race. It's like you're a fucking bitch. At that time, she was pretty much a she was a bitch. Like I don't know how any but anybody in Mickey's world stomached her because she was actually a bitch. I'm surprised Donald didn't. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm going dark places. I'm going to stop. Whoa! I'm doing great! It's never actually occurred to me that the nephews have different voices. It's subtle. The money is random. I've always kind of... I mean, they probably have the same voice actor. Mm. But... I've always just assumed that they were a hive mind. I mean, sometimes they are. Oh, hey, I should go take a quick, quick jaunt down to the basement and see if the speed spirit's still down there. Also, so here's the part that's going to make, like, a lot of Disney fans upset. Like, older Disney fans. It, it did for me, but it's not, like, to the point of I, like, wrote an angry letter. So, you know how Pete's, like, the asshole of Disney, right? Obviously, uh, he's friends with the main cast in the in the uh, children's cartoon that's on right now, like for young children. I mean, whatever. <laughs> oh yeah. People are allowed to change, Scooter. No, they're not. They're allowed to be assholes. That's why I am on re. <laughs> I mean, hi, I love you. Okay, Speed Spear's gone. Fuck. I'm still in hell, in case you were wondering. I mean, I've I'm, restarted I'm... this. I've restarted this track about 25 times so far. I have completed two laps successfully. All right, let me do this before I go back and heal, because I never sucked up one of these guys, and I think it counts for the compendium. Ow! 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 Boom! Crap. Uh, we'll do that in a minute. <laughs> Wait, question is, why do I know that Pete is friends with the main cast of the Mickey crew? Uh, it's a little thing called, I've had to babysit my nephews. I believe you. It's basically how anybody also found out about Blue's Clues, if, unless they have their own kids. They took, they babysit their younger I mean, siblings, or, yeah. I was a child when Blue's Clues was a thing. This is true. You are young. Okay. And hurt. I caught the ghost, technically, and that's what I needed. Okay. To... Blue's Clues was my shit when I was little, though. Let's be real. Okay. So you want... Okay. So here's minor confession time. I... So... My mom... Babe, uh, did babysitting to ca as her job while I was still in school. Uh, grades, not grade schooling. Uh, general education schooling. But over the summer, I would have to watch the kids while she did something. And 
Blue's Clues would come on, and I'd be, and I would just be entranced, like, dude, this is actually well, like, decently animated. For the fact everything's like made out of cardboard. For like a week. How are you gonna say you were actually entertained by Blue's Clues, which is valid because Blue's Clues is fucking. Baller. Well, the story doesn't quite end. So, for a reason, the school started back up. Started back up for about a week. I f somehow at, uh, at one point I found out that Blue's Clues aired at like 4:35 in the morning. Hi, guy. And for about a week, I was waking up to watch that episode of Blue's Clues that aired, and then going back to sleep. <laughs> And then they got caught. That's funny. <laughs> it's like, here I am, 12 years old, way beyond the need to be watching any of this stuff. I'm way smarter than it. I'm still, I'm still watching it. Where do I go? I Blue's lost. Clues is a series for intellectuals, dude. <laughs> you know that Dora shit? Miss me with that weak garbage. Miss me with Dora the Explorer. Oh, I don't have fire anymore. Oops. I almost had it. Tragic. How could this if, happen? If I ever like stop talking for a second, it's because I made it to the last lap in one piece. Stop trying to suck up the bomb ghost. Oh my god. Up here. Stop trying to suck. Mm -hmm. Did you see my snap earlier, by the way? I. Can I? I'll be real with you, Chief. I barely boot up Snapchat. My phone is right here. I don't you, boot up. I mean, I pretty much only use it to listen to the snaps that the uh, elevator party group sends. Okay. But I sent out a snap there. I don't know if you're in that group or not, but if you are, you should look at my snap because I was really proud of it. Uh, if I remember after I'm done tonight, I'll try to, but right now, no. Like, here's the thing. I'm not even playing Dragalia Lost, like, on the side. I'm not even doing that, because I'm focusing on this game. I'm actually being a good streamer for once. Bye. Bye, Goofy. Slay you later, fucker. Goofy. Please. Garsh. Goofy, this is <laughs> Goofy. This is the children's racing game. Listen, out here on the on the road, there's rules, and the rules say, <laughs> and the rules say, witness me. <laughs> I don't know what they just went on. Witness me is a Mad Max thing, right? It is. Yes, I'm basically drawing parallels that Mickey Speedway USA is as hellish as as Mad Max. <laughs> I mean, okay. Mad Max definitely isn't a video game. It, it actually is. <laughs> is there a Mad Max video game? I believe there was a Mad Max video game. And uh, there's like a movie. There's a movie and then there's a video game that's like not tied to the movie, but promotes the movie at the same time. I mean, I'm assuming Fury Road wasn't the first Mad Max movie. No, there was the several. Fury Road was really good. Here's the part where the world gets upset with me and said and yells at me because I guess who hasn't seen it. I mean that's okay. I haven't seen a lot of movies people like. Speaking of like, I don't want to go to a movie right now. I'm not in the mood for it like this week. Maybe it'll change by tomorrow or something. But there are shy guys in the laundry room. That was a non sequitur. Um. No, sorry, uh... No, uh, I don't want to see a movie right now, but I'm interested in seeing Bohemi Bohemian Rhapsody. That's a JoJo stand. That's also a movie about a song, and, a, and now a movie about, basically, Queen, but more or less Freddie Mercury. I know what Bohemian Rhapsody is, Scooter. No, you don't. I have to tell you everything. I must spoon feed you everything, my son. Don't ever let me repeat am that getting, sentence. Am I getting bruises on my fingers from just holding the N64 controller? That's awkward. 
Uh, hey, so the hat's no longer in the laundry room. Yeah, they moved the locations of things. Did Fuck. I forget to tell you that? I think I mentioned that, and I forgot that. <laughs> I thought, Everything oh. Everything is different except for the star. The star's still in the observatory. Oh. Shit, my guy. Fuck me. You know what? Oh, okay. Fuck you too, Goofy. I was gonna say, even though I fell off the bridge, I'm gonna try to keep this run going anyway. And then the instant I land, I get put back on the track, Goofy knocks me off the bridge again. Sorry, dude. Goofy See you later, Yui. Kids. Like, I think the funniest thing about Goofy, I guess it could also be attributed to, like, a lot of other characters in other games, uh, most notably, like, Tiny from Crash, from Crash Bandicoot series, is why is the stupidest motherfucker the most qualified to do everything? <laughs> Oof. Listen, Goofy has a son and he is allowed to drive a car. I have seen, I've seen maybe Mickey drive a car, maybe Donald, but nobody else. I mean, you've seen everyone in this game drive a car. That's true. I'm going to go okay, save now that I've okay, gathered my money. Stormy my money. weather is actually really useful in single player because it slows the bots down. Hmm. And because the bots don't need to, like, do precise things, it's better for them to get... Fuck off me! Someone seems rather upsetty in their spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then back to Kingdom Hearts. Goofy is the king of the night of the Knights Guard, or the leader of the Knights Guard's help. I was saying the Knights Guard it has a king. Look, I forgot the proper term. I'm also incredibly stupid. Hmm? Why are the why are there fish in this flying fish in this room? Stop touching! Don't touch me! Don't touch me, motherfucker! I'm gonna soak every single one of you up. I have to reignite his fire because I went to the lab, don't, don't I? Light my fire. This is safe. the power. Man, imagine Mickey speak what you would say, but with Euro beat playing in the background. I have a feeling you would enjoy Oregon a lot more if you were going over that jump and you just heard Deja Vu, hi and hi. <laughs> Deja Vu, I've been here in this place before, higher on the streets. I need to, I like, listen to that song I doubt more it, or something. by the way. Although a better song would help, because this song kind of sucks. You know what? Uh, you know what? Uh, that, that tears it. You're going to need to mod your copy of Mickey Speedway USA to have a better song for Oregon. Just Oregon. Yahoo! Huh. Things you learn. Apparently you're... Apparently the strobe bulb just flat out destroys smaller pests. That makes also, sense. also the fact that they added like you can choose between traditional flashlight options in this game or if you want to play with the strobe bulb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh oops. Well there with that platinum. There with that star platinum. No, I'm a Joe Jokester! I wonder what the speedrun community is. What the speedrun community say is like. Uh -oh. God damn it. Mm -hmm. Flying fash! Holy shit! Am I out of hell? I'm out of hell! Here, out of I survived Oregon! I survived the Oregon Trail! Thank God, dude. I'd like to say it's smooth sailing from here, but that's Colorado. Uh, oh. I almost got it perfect again. That's okay. Texas is actually kind of easy. I'm pretty sure that he's going to be a bronze because I kept like breaking the line immediately. Oh, the strobe bulb? 
Um, the strobulb is something from Dark Moon. Basically, I think they added it to the game to basically, for those that played Dark Moon first, and then pick this game up afterwards, thinking this was like some weird sequel. Is the strobulb the dark light? No. Strobulb is, is, uh, you, well, it's like from Dark Moon. You charge it up, and then when you pop it, that's what, that's when it will I haven't stomp. played Dark Moon in a long-ass time, Okay. Dude. Basically, you char you sit there and charge it up, and then when you when you it's fully charged, you release it, and that's when what well, stuns them. The longer you do it, the longer they're stunned. Instead of like the flashlight from the original release of Luigi's yeah. Mansion, where it was like <clears throat> where it was like uh, like bad terminology for it, but like mouse over them, they get stunned and then they di dissipate right away. I like it. I mean, did you not just turn off the flashlight so you had to stun something ever? No. Then again, I also played it when I was a, a dumb kid. I mean, that's how they intended you to do it, was you turn off the flashlight and then you turn it back on when they're close to you. No, I just learned how to, like, swing swing that like a fucking 2 by 4 at something. <laughs> you never tried hitting the B button at any point playing the game? When I was bored walking down the hallways. Okay. Can I literally reiterate that I was stupid? Goon. You, Little you is a goon. <laughs> Trust me, there are so many things in games from the GameCube era that I don't remember that I could do or that I could have done at some point to make my life easier, and I was just stupid. Like... Hat weird light? Oh, you're talking about this light here in the middle of the room? That's just the very bad, like, basic lamp. You're talking about this light? That's a fire elemental. That's right, elementals are a thing in that game. I'm like, what the fuck? Is this WoW? You know, you mentioned that, and this is where I tell you, by the way, I played an elemental shaman and used to top the damage charts. <laughs> I mean, isn't that a DPS shaman build? Yes, it is a DPS shaman build, but like a lot of people wrote it off because wrote it off initially for whatever reason. Mm -hmm. Or it got wow. it got written off as bad, and I fucked up the suck. Yeah, I'm definitely getting a bruise on my index finger from holding this controller. How are you? Hold are you crab clawing that thing, my guy? No, it's like on the side of my next controller. Oh, you're just okay. That's fr that's frustration grip. I mean, maybe. Listen, I too played N64 and or Super Nintendo games. I understand frustration grip. I also understand seeing how how I could snap my controller because I wasn't winning. No, I didn't try to get good. I tried to snap my controller first. <laughs> Bar. Okay, I'm back with a dog. Hey, Brown. Pupper? Is it is it pupper time? No, she left. Oh. Oh right, shy guy. <laughs> I am a goon. I keep forgetting these shy guys don't respond to light until you suck off the masks. My natural instinct when I open a chest to see a ghost is just immediately flash the light and stay alive. I would say, consider. Oh, God, don't touch me, poison mushroom. I would say, considering the fact Luigi has had two games, soon to be three. Focused around how much money he can he can ascertain as the as the ranking for it. Luigi's probably richer at this point. And then there's Wario. Luigi has a net worth. Luigi has a net worth better than Mario, better than Waluigi. <laughs> Also, to be fair, doesn't Mario own the house from uh, Mario Land 2? Oh yeah, he owns that castle. He owns that bitch. <laughs> We haven't seen it since then, but he owns that bitch. I hear castles are pretty cheap, though. In the Mushroom Kingdom, at least. 
No, in this world too. I'm pretty. I'm pretty sure I've heard that you can like. There are like European nations that are like selling castles for pretty cheap. As long as you like promise to not break it and to like do maintenance on it occasionally, they'll like let you rent out like old castles or something. Like Airbnb castles. Like you like like an actual rent, not like an Airbnb. Oh. Like an actual, you live there. That is strangest. That is strange. Oh, was that? Oh, was that chest? It's because they're old and probably aren't that equipped for the modern amenities. Like, right. Like you would need to bring yourself a generator if you wanted to like do modern technology things in it. You would need to do this and that in order to upkeep everything. Like you're Guys, basically. I want a castle. Yeah, you're basically. Basically, someone, like, put, like, it's more structurally sound, but someone basically just took, like, about 22 by 4s plopped it in the middle of the field, and said, hey, I'll, I'll let you live in here for $100 a month. Hmm. Nara, put the bad purple man away. Nobody wants to see that shit. It's disgusting. Oops. I hope but I don't kill myself. Put the girl, put the good purple man in there, Wario. Fuck! I ran into a bomb. <laughs> oh. Also, my my dudes, my guys, my broskies, my brostradamuses, my brofestuses. What do you want? Smash in like twelve hours. Yeah, I wonder if the leaks will be confirmed to be true. Yeah. I've said this everywhere, and like people are probably gonna tire me of saying I'm saying this too. But what's gonna happen with that? What's gonna happen? I mean, is I'm like, not gonna say anything else about the leaks other than no, I wonder. No. I'm not saying I'm not saying the leaks whatsoever. I'm not I'm not at, divulging the information of the leaks. I was I saw like a corner of a leak. Because people on Twitter don't know how to understand spoilers and leaks are spoilers and leaks and not everybody wants to see them. <laughs> I'd argue nobody wants to see leaks, but... Yeah, um, some people do, because five minutes of fame. Yes, that's the thing. So I'm going to take a like a quick pause break here just to talk about this. So, the leak is... Get your band hammers ready, too. Because, yeah. you know, some idiot in chat is going to, like, mention something about it. Yeah, which, by the way, yeah, don't mention this leak. That, that leak is null, is basically grounds for, at the very least, for the rest of the night timeout. You're banned. But, the, the it was basically, what happened was, a fr uh, French, uh, somebody from France, who was on the art team for Smash Ultimate, we're gonna call him the Grinch. He was no, the he's Grinch. No, not Ultimate. It's some guy who works for like a company that handles promotional materials. Oh, okay. Basically, he had that, and he sent an Instagram private message to one of his friends saying, "Oh, hey, look at this. This is the premise for it. This might not actually be true." And that person said, "Oh, this is neat." To the internet. Yeah, kinda. It's dumb. And I don't know. The, my opinion on the leaks are big if true, but also fuck you. How dare you show me this? Um. But basically, here's how it's gonna play out. Both scenarios. Leaks are true. Every motherfucker who stood by the leaks are gonna be staying there, just going, "Ha! I told you I was right. I told you I was right." For for the next until the game launches. But if it's fake. Like, you, keep in mind, there are people who have been, you, like, when you think toxic, you think, like, League of Legends community or World of Warcraft community. Literally yes. any online game community. Some are worse than others. Okay. That's not true at all, actually. The Sonic fan base. <laughs> Toxicity. 
Like they have been that level of toxic to people trying to like saying like, dude, this is fake and debunking it. They've been that level of asshole. And then those people are going to at, at approximately like, let's see, 10 EST, 40, at 11 o'clock EST are going to be online scrambling, trying to delete every single message they ever sent because they've been assholes to every single person that tried to debunk their, their golden leak. Uh, most people who like think the leaks are true aren't really happy that the information got leaked in the first place. You know, it's like... Fair enough. The Simon reveal got leaked for me, and I'm still really bitter about that. Oh, I didn't see that. I heard but the I music I didn't get got... the leak per se, but I saw a bunch of memes on Twitter about Simon getting leaked. The <laughs> night before Simon, the Simon reveal. Mine was. Uh, it was like it was like a it, it was a screenshot from Simon or from from Simon from uh, Castlevania Two, you know where it has the werewolf thing and it was just uh, what a terrible night to have a leak. Oh. That was the meme I saw and it was a funny meme but I was still pissed. Also, Blaze can do it. I'm. That's the one thing I know. I wish I had a better way to do this. Like, I'm gonna just gonna let go, but just know that's like grounds right there, because I that's the one thing I did see. Like that's how strict see, I'm being about I it. I kind of want to moderate your chat, but I also don't care because it's your chat. Yeah. That and I think better Twitch TV is not working for me properly. I can't like do the quick two second like quick phase out thing. Also, yeah, Nera, I've been there, like, everybody has, like, the three characters they want, above all else. I've been saying, at least for the time we've had Smash Ultimate in the work, in the knowledge base, I've been like, Bandanity, Isaac from Golden Sun, Shantae. What's gonna happen? Probably none of those, and I'm probably gonna get all big sad, but what if? I've actually been the opposite, where I have a few characters where I'll be kind of disappointed if they're at it, because it's like, really? But... Like whatever. I don't get really passionate about Nintendo characters. Okay, I need uh, a little bit of silence here. The, the most I've wanted from Ultimate is I wanted the meme. I, I, I want, I so dearly want for the meme dream to have Rex and Pyra be character 69. Rex and Pyra, also Super Mario Bros. 3. I come to the realization, uh, maybe Huey sucks. Maybe Huey is the weak link. I mean, I'm gonna keep doing it because if I switch characters, it means I have to do Oregon. You have to go to Oregon again. But... I mean, the thing with the nephews is they're all just better than a stock character, but like. I mean, against AI, that doesn't matter too much, because rubber banding, hell. Uh-huh. <sighs> yeah, also, the whole fact with this ghost. Very impressive! You can understand music that's older than you! Die. I do feel bad for, like, some people, because... They grew like these kids, like kids that are playing this. By the way, mostly kids are gonna have this. Go away. Go into the, go in the piano room. Please tell me that's what you did. Yes, you did. Like most kids that are gonna have. Did he rehide? No, he went to a different room. Shit. Which room did he go in? Oh no, can I not get him right now? Have I been? Have I been? Have I been? He probably bamboozled? went into the waiting room. Yeah, you're right. Which means like, I would have to leave the mansion again to respawn. What do you mean that? Can't you just remember to get him once you go to the weight room? Well, I don't know if I'll go through the whole thing in one go tonight. The weight room is still a bit out. 
Yeah, I guess it is, huh? Like that's 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 the second room of area three. And I have to go. I never opened the chest, so I don't know where I have to go. <laughs> I don't think it's called the weight room, by the way. I think it has a different name. The ultimate muscle. Awesome. Like the training room or something? Probably. I mean, there's so many names for rooms in this game that I can't remember. There's a fucking... I mean, the only one I remember that's weird as hell is there's a sitting room. Yeah, I think that's a European thing. It's the whole concept of the room. Go in and sit, have a sit down. There's nothing else in the I mean, fucking room. I mean, it's like a tea room. I get well. There is a tea set in that room, so that does make more sense now. Oh, I also think there is another room in the mansion that's called the tea room. So. I think that room is. I think that's the room where you get a uh, ice. Where boy. you get ice. Ice, ice, baby. Really, you're hiding in the piano, my guy. Why? He really likes that one episode of Tom and Jerry. Okay, mad respect. Man, Cat Concerto was one of the best things in any cartoon ever. Like, Tom and Jerry was just good. And I think they're... Like, it's not... It's... I feel like the new set is just as good. Is there a new set? Yeah. I there, really don't know. Yeah, there's a new set where, like... They do have a little bit of voice work, but it's never from Tom and Jerry. It's from, like, the side characters, you know, Spike and whatnot. I'm pretty sure that was always a thing, though. Actually, Tom would speak sometimes in the old cartoons. So yeah, it was, like, like really once uh, it was like once a season or something like that. God, my most visceral memories are from the one Tom and Jerry episode of the one where uh, he's just serenading the one chick with like this dumb love song and Jerry has had enough of it because he's trying to sleep or whatever and it's like is you is or is you wait my baby I, I love that episode that was a dumb song I love it. it it's a very dumb song <laughs> but I love it I so. vividly remember that episode maybe babies found somebody no who is my baby still my baby true? And then smash <laughs> and then smash cut to <laughs> One day when I'm like really edgy, I'll set it so whenever I get a text message it plays the Tom scream. Can you imagine just like getting a text? I think it would be funny. I feel like the the uh, Jerry would be more apt for a text message, and Tom would be just like, "What's always going when you have a phone call coming in?" <laughs> I don't know the Jerry scream. It's basically the same thing, but it's like high. Oh, they just it like, pitch change ah, it. Ah, it's, that yeah, one? yeah, like they basically just pitch change it. I like an immigrant it. song. Now that I think about it. The immigrant song, by the way. <laughs> ah. I'm just mad the last time, like, Lucky streamed, you you were doing that because you were mad at something. And, like, I immediately, like, followed you toward into Immigrant Song. That's literally the only thing I know about Immigrant Song, by the way. I mean, just same. the beginning. I actually didn't even know it was called Immigrant Song until, like, a month ago. Some recent time. Real fun. You know, I'm struggling in Texas a lot more than I thought I would. Bigger, better, yeehaw. <laughs> also, man. It's not like Texas isn't hard, but it's decidedly easier than uh, Oregon is. I'd say it's probably the second easiest track in this Grand Prix. Also, get ready for like five cycles of Mr. Lugs. I'm terrible at Mr. Lux. No, I'd say it is the easiest one in this Grand Prix. Because... I, yeah, it's definitely the easiest of the four. It's debatable between this and Hawaii. Listen, I know a thing about too much hot sauce, and that's a lie. What? 
Uh, I'm fighting Mr. Lugs with, you know, the fireballs after you take away his food. Ah, right. He does that. It's been a while. It's been a while. <laughs> Since I could hold my head up high. Fucking boo ball. That's okay. Me having issues with this is more time spent talking about things. Ah, oh, fuck. There we go. This lap is going pretty smooth so far. Dude, somebody told me about, like, going to Sriracha f f Factory is, like, oh, you have to, like, wear several layers of protection. Oh, fuck, he went in that room. I thought this that was a hallway. But, like, if you go to the Sriracha Factory, like, you have to wear, like, se like airtight seal goggles and a face mask and all that jazz because of all the cayenne floating around. Okay, but, uh, counterpoint. Why would you ever go to the Sriracha Factory? Farf said his brother does, so that's why I'm bringing it up. And, like, an annual trip to the Sriracha Factory, even. <laughs> An annual trip to the Sriracha Factory sounds like uh, the spiritual successor, the Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Actually, Char Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Yeah. Also, okay, Actually, I'm Charlie and the Chocolate Factory was the sequel, wasn't it? Yes. Also, I'm dumb. Remember? I forgot that hmm. not Frank's Red Hot, Fr Frank's Red Hot, which I put on everything. No, no pun on their slogan. No, Sriracha, it would be a whole bunch of, like, red pepper or whatever, or, and garlic. That's what would be in the air. Listen, Sriracha's fucking tasty. I'll fight you in this. I don't like sauces. I, like, don't like the texture of sauces in general. Got him. Uh, you've probably seen Sriracha. Hold on. Because, uh, no, be me being me, I have a bottle. You definitely know what Sriracha is. Enjoy that shaking sound effect. That's Sriracha. Ingredients, because they have it on the back of this here. Chili, uh, chili, sugar, salt, garlic, distilled vinegar, potassium sorbate, and sodium bisulfate as preservatives. Sriracha is the is the hot sauce that has the rooster on the front of it, so we call it cock sauce. Cock sauce, yeah. Anyway, I beat Texas while you were gone. Uh, I wasn't gone too long. Yeah, keep, remember, I've got headless wireless headphones, so you could always complain at me. Which means it's time for Colorado, also known as the Rainbow Road of this game. What? Far if not a fan of Rocco's Modern Life, but as my neighbor Totoro, how dare you? How dare even? Blaze can do it. It's cock sauce. L let's be honest, it's cock sauce. You cocky cock. Anyway, Colorado and mirror mode is gonna be really hard. I feel like it's not as bad as Oregon, but it's still, like, uh, close to Oregon. Mm, well, the thing with Colorado is none of the turns are that difficult, but they're just really, like, jaggedy. Like, there are no straight lines. There are just like random divots. In Holy and out. shit! <laughs> random mouse, gold mouse spawn. By the way, ah shit! There was a golden mouse in Mr. Lugs's room, and I forget and I missed it. I'm a fool. 
The big issue with Colorado is the turns are sharp, and they all look the same. So, like, when you once you get your feel for it, it's really not that difficult. Yeah. Horse, I like. I can come it's back just here. It's long and really interesting. I'm not getting that piece of cheese in the blackout. No, I am making a beeline to the basement during the. Well, I have to get, no. Uncle Grimsley is now required during this in this mansion, but beyond him, I'm making a beeline to the basement. What do you think Uncle Grimsley is not required? In the original Luigi's Mansion? I don't know. Well, I don't remember how. I feel like he wasn't required in the original Luigi's Mansion. You go straight to the breaker room after the blackout no, occurs. No, no, the breaker, the breaker room is locked. If you don't, he has the key to the breaker room. Oh, so I always thought. The, they lock the breaker room, and you have to catch him to get the key. Huh. Like, I, I know, it threw me off when I was a kid, too. They'll be like, oh, I know where the break room is. I'll just go there. Why is it locked now? Anyway. <sighs> Fucking door. No, no, you just, you just, uh, come on, baby, let me, let me light your fire. Light my fire. Don't forget the water plants. I'm killing the guy. There. Don't forget the water plants. Uh, that's probably going to take a moment to do right now, now that I've got got it, the metal. Like, I'm literally picking it up right now. Don't forget the ice is nice. Actually, is there a point to ice at all besides... Uh... Just the five water ghosts in the entire mansion. <laughs> There'll probably be more in this version. More than likely. But I'm like, you never have to use it for an element puzzle, do you? No. You, you have to. You have once. to make the bath holes, right? I remember. It. You do it once in the uh, sewage area or the base in the basement. Also, <sighs> water balls and fireballs. Luigi, don't have too much fun with your new squirt gun. Fuck you, Dad! Oh, I missed. Water bobble, come here. Good boy. Boo ball. Oh my god. Don't worry, I got ya. Man, get in my vacuum. The thing with Colorado is the entire track, it's like, if you miss the turn, you're off a cliff. If you turn too hard, you're running into a wall. Which, and then when you try to self, when you try to self right, you turn off the cliff. Mm, no, you just lose all your speed. Because you're hitting a cliff. I guess that's more me, because I always play characters with terrible handling but high speed, you know, like Goofy. I like that control scheme. It's really bad in this game, though. Well, it's good if you know what you're doing. But, like, if you stop one time as Goofy, you just immediately lose the entire race. Because it actually takes you, like, half a minute to get back to top speed. Sorry, I had to take a moment to remember where all the uh, plants were. There are a lot of plants. Like right now, there's not. Right now, there's like a dozen. But when you get to the roof, there then it just like triplicates. <gasps> the three dozen. God, I. I don't hate this. This track is not nearly as bad. I just wish I could remember anything about it. Like I said, a lot of the turns look the same. I guess that's how they make it, like, the final hardest track, is they make all the turns look the same, so you're not prepared for how you have to turn through them. I mean, there's a lot of them, and the track is long. Hmm. 
Oh fuck. Sometimes there's there's just sometimes there's just holes. Sometimes there's just a hole that you just forget about. Cause you don't get that far normally. You want this hole. You you want this hole. Mario Golf memes, by the way. Okay, I've watered that plant. Um, Chelsea doesn't have a plant. Lady or Norbol Norman, whatever the hell his name is. First Ghost doesn't have a plant. He's normal. Hmm. Isn't his name Neville? That's it, Neville. Yeah, that's right. I fuck you, Mickey. Okay. Oh, see you later. I remember things. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, fucko! <laughs> Precisely. <laughs> Have fun in hell, Huey! Did someone mention the door of the darkness? Mickey, you're too late, okay? <laughs> oh, oh, I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for the, I'm waiting for the feels bad man's. I mean, I've never played a Kingdom Hearts game. Uh, that one, well, you've seen the trailer. No, I haven't. Basic. I don't care about Kingdom Hearts. Fair enough. Um. I'm gonna heal, I'm gonna heal up because I'm basically going out to the final boss of this area. Um. Birth by Sleep was a game that basically acted as a predecessor to the entire series and everybody fucking fell in love with the female character Aqua in that game. Hey! Always a mistake, I'm sure. Aqua is never a good name for a character to have. Uh... Someone help me on the other names. Basically, the other two characters were had name puns based off of Earth and uh, hmm? Air. But in the trailer for in one of the trailers for Kingdom Hearts three, Aqua Terra and Ventus. Terra is a big buff dude. Ventus is your Sora. Anyway, basically in the Kingdom Hearts trailer, Aqua, like, Mickey is like Aqua. Is that you? You're too late, Mickey. And she turns on. And she's got like the devil eyes of the game. Ah, I remember now. Yeah, that's Aqua. I have never known a good character named Aqua, ever. And I've known a few characters named Aqua. Yeah, but yeah, people actually have, like... If they don't appreciate her as a character, they have a hard on for her for other reasons. I mean, they're obvious. Isn't it like every character in Kingdom Hearts is either Sora, Kairi, or Riku, or Xenonord? Like, that's just how it is? Kind of, yeah. So apparently, Eeyore. Fuck. Puppy, leave me alone. Spooky, leave me alone. I have to. I have to give you a bone. They really did name the stupid dog ghost Spooky, didn't they? Yes. Bye, Minnie. I guess we can fell off the track. But rubber banding will put him in second place the second he comes back. Or I guess who's your rival when you play as Huey? Um, there's not like a dedicated rival system actually. Okay. It's based on the track and the character stats. So like in this track where there's a lot of turns, uh, you're generally racing against Minnie and Daisy. Cause because tight, ha they tight handling. Drive off cliffs. Well, I actually took no damage from the dog. Dog is hard. Um. Dog's not hot. Okay, you're watching. Sorry, I didn't mean to spoil you on that blazing dude. Like, I don't know the full story of 
Birth by Sleep. I just know that she's one of the three characters you play as, and people love her because of her story. Or if not for the story, then they're quite thirsty lads, we'll say. This is an extreme thirst. Damn it, that's not it. Ugh. Come on, which one of you is it? Whoa. That's it. Fuck me! We're getting the hang of this slowly. Like, I know you're just trying to go for max rank right now, but do you have to get a... Uh, do you have to do, like, all in one route, or do you get to retry each course? Uh, you get to retry individual tracks as much as you want. Okay. I mean, normally, you only get three retries per Grand Prix, but you only want the thing that gives you once. Mm -hmm. So I'm using, of course, because I'm a little bitch. Yeah, well, let's say, be careful, Nera is a, I don't know, avid, but like, at least a big-ish fan of Kingdom Hearts as a series. He will gun you down. <laughs> it's bad. It kind of suffers. It kind of suffers fanfiction.net self sim I mean, self insert I've stories. Never played a Kingdom Hearts game, so I don't actually. Need I to have to follow it because one of my only friends left from high school, besides the ones I hang out with, like occasionally around here, like she is gaga over Kingdom Hearts. I mean, I can see why people like it. I just mainly never had a PlayStation 2, so never I've, had a way to play it. I mean, I've got a PlayStation 2, but now it's but, now it's just now it's like no, you have to get the PlayStation 4 so you can play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix 2.8 Alpha Edition Turbocharged. Actually, Nera, I, I think, think Kingdom Hearts is more enjoyable to me the less I know about it. Um, Nera. Correct me if I'm wrong, but or I guess chat in general. Correct me if I'm wrong. Isn't there like a final collection coming out like a month or two be before uh, the launch of the Kingdom Hearts Three? Oh, it's, it's already out. That's my thought. Yeah, there's basically I'm like us. That was like that had 2.8 final mix or whatever. It had like, like every game yeah. in the entire series in it, including the plot line for the stupid web game. That's apparently canon. Oh, I'm not gonna one cycle this guy. Mickey, stop trying to kill me! Like, all I remember is a lot of people were going were just like, dude, I'm rewarded for my patience now. I remember rewarded for my patience for not buying any other games because now I can buy this Super version that's on all systems that's on PS4 that will explain the entire plot to me so I don't have to go buy every single one of the other games. And it's gonna be all 40 know, bucks. All I know about Kingdom Hearts is that everyone is either Sora, Kairi, or Riku. Or has a dark past. And uh, everything in the donkey video. That's all I know about Kingdom Hearts. This is a bad idea. Oh my god, I just managed to get away. I'm finally getting the hang of this huge frag. I think. God damn. Look, don't bother giving him a summary. He will not listen. <laughs> like I, I love see I love ceiling, but I, but it's basically if he doesn't want to know anything about something, he will not know anything about something. It's more so that I just don't have any interest in the games, and so I won't go out of my way to learn the lore. Where are you? And, as I said earlier, like, a minute ago, I think it's more entertaining to me not knowing anything, so I, so I can just make dumb, uninformed jokes. Kind of, same, kind of. Gorge? Oh, one health left, fuck you! 
I hate Bogmire with a passion. Bogmire is big spooky, dude. Dude, Bogmire is the boss I always fuck up on the most. Like, and that's saying a lot, considering Bulossus is in this game. Dude, Bulossus scared the fuck out of me when I was a kid. Although we don't get the we don't get the PAL version. We don't get the PAL version of the fight where you have to ride on the poltergust. Don't worry, I gotcha. Uh. Every time I hear that, I die a little inside. Um. Well, like, what is it, you know, like, everybody's like, oh man, the Legend of Zelda lore is so complex, we need, like, an actual official book on it. We got, t like, three books, and some of it still doesn't make sense. If they ever released an I encyclopedia... Mean, the Zelda timeline makes, like, the official Zelda timeline just makes Zelda make less sense. But, if they ever made, it like, an encyclopedia for Kingdom Hearts, that thing is gonna be a dictionary. I'm not talking, like, figuratively, like, I'm not talking, like, figure, like, literally, it's going to be the size and density of a dictionary. I mean, like Homestuck is. Stop. <laughs> oh. I mean, it's true. Speaking of Homestuck. Speaking okay, of. Okay, I immediately regret every decision I've ever made in my life leading up to this moment. <laughs> Delta Rune. What? Undertale Two. Delta Rune. Oh, is that the thing Toby was announcing on Twitter? Yeah, and apparently it's apparently people have press releases already. Delta Rune? It's an anagram of of Undertale. Okay, so yes. Rune as in like RuneScape. Yes. <laughs> she should have come up with a better name, honestly. Like overhead. Right, but Or like Anda Dedu. Ugh. Like people think I'm joking. No, there's, there's a, fr uh, I haven't talked to him well, but there's a friend I have <coughs> in the UK who, a lot of times for new releases he's excited for, or once he gets press releases on, he'll like sit down and grind out the entirety of the game over the course of a day, and for recording, and push it out there immediately. So he has like he's currently uploading. This, he's currently uploading the uh, Delta Rune footage. What does it have to do with Homestuck? Homestuck has a lot of ties to Undertale, for some reason. The only tie Homestuck has to Undertale is that Toby Fox made a song, and will never let that song die. <laughs> and then he put that song in Undertale. Look, that's a tie. A weak-ass tie that's basically just, like, the tie you have holding your bread closed before you open it. But it's a tie. <laughs> oh. There's nothing more frustrating than you falling off a cliff and also seeing the AIs also fall off the same cliff. But not all of them. Home, like I, I'm gonna keep my hands out of the pot on Homestuck though. Like that, that is a batch of bad that I don't want anything to do with. I mean, it's not that bad. I've read most of it. Dara, I was just telling you that Undertale Two is out. Sorry. Alright. Uh, from what I've read of Homestuck, I enjoyed it. Anyway, I stopped Grisella. near the end. I constantly forget you can't send trace chasers backwards. Wish this game had a better item system, to be honest. God damn it. Ace job on the P, Nera. Good job for you. 
Did you S rank? Did you S rank that P or did you B rank it? <laughs> I'm gonna stop. This is a terrible bit. I need to stop. On the NFC touch point, the figure can pee. Oh yeah. <laughs> also, we're introducing sick mode. <laughs> we're introducing sick mode. <laughs> Good, video. Good video, by the way. I'm glad that Soup or Smash Brothers is the the gift that keeps on giving in terms of quality memes. Uh, all right. I need to get well, some no water. No longer able to... to play classic mode. Instead, we're introducing sick mode. Mm -hmm. Uh. I regret many decisions I made in life, but this is not one of them. Fuck me. Guys, Colorado is hard. I imagine that's what it's like to actually drive Colorado. I mean, it's a mountain place. Mountain place. There's a lot of terrible, a lot of mountains you got to go around. On a subsequent, on a subsequent, and not really that related point. That's if I ever move out of this state. I, that's oddly enough one of the states I want to move to is Colorado. Why? Same, different location, same temperature, roughly. Listen, I like how I like my weather how it is right now. I'm just kind of tired of the state. I'm, I mean that's valid, but also I don't think Colorado is the climate you think it does. Maybe it does. I don't know. I haven't actually been there. I've driven through it, but... Um... I was going to say something. Does Colorado have a cold climate? I guess I should ask people who've lived there instead of just saying things. Well, I like... mean, you can look at it on the map, and like, even though the U.S. is like on a curvature, it's still on the map towards the north. I mean, it's definitely not as far north as Washington is. But Washington is also on the coast, so... It gets very cold because of the coast breeze. It doesn't really get that cold here, actually. It never snows. It's never cold enough to snow. Well, it's cold enough to be miserable. I mean, it definitely rains a lot here, but that's not a bad thing. Oh, no. Not a bad thing, especially if you're... Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Someone you know, a like nerd, me. and like to be inside, I like a like nerd. Me. I like to be inside because I am a nerd. I mean, I like to be outside in the rain. You are unable to pause while you're falling in a pit, and that's really irritating. That must have been like some kind of workaround they had to work with or something. Get. Mm. Fucking. I think it's because you don't have control of your character, so they don't let you do anything that you would have. Let me just. Another really annoying thing about Colorado is that it has a lot of these signposts that have collision on them, even though they probably shouldn't have collision on them, considering they're like not on the track. Oh god, this track is hard. Okay, there's even more ghosts out here. Nice. I'm afraid no ghost. That's one. My friend, Mr. Ghost. Oh, you can light it up oh. before you go in the well this time. Nice. Oh, it's a red chest. That's, uh, that's a glove. Glove is outside, and it's still sweaty. You outside normally? No, the glove is in um I don't remember where it is normally. It's inside normally. 
Uh, that or Toad oh, has it. Oh, it's the projection room, I remember now. Anyway, let's trigger this cutscene that always plays. Game, even if it's making me miserable right now. You wanna come back out again, buddy? Mm -hmm. Buddy, I, I miss you the first time. You wanna come back out? That mushroom is going on a journey. Oh shit, it's going on a journey for me! <laughs> Bit, boot. No. Man, I should bring my N64 to Momo. Just so we could play this and suffer. If you got room in your suitcase. I mean, I mean the, my suitcase is pretty big. That and the N64 is definitely smaller than the uh, big old brick bone Xbox. I mean. That I definitely brought last time and I did play like for like all of 10 minutes. We played it. We played it for like half an hour and like, okay, that was fun. Yeah, I was like, hey guys, let's play Fusion Frenzy. And then we played Fusion Frenzy for like a third of a game. And then everyone left. And I was like, oh. Like, I was enjoying Like, I was enjoying it. Even though I didn't remember how to play it's it at all. But I was enjoying it. It's a good game. Fusion Frenzy, good game. Surprising no one. Shame the sequel sucked. Want to play Sumo Balls in the sequel? I mean, Sumo is in the sequel. Because uh, I feel like Sumo wasn't like the headlining game in the in the first game, but the sequel, they were like Sumo. It's all don't look at Sumo. Don't look at this. Don't look at this. But Sumo. I mean, there were some okay mini games in two, but the game itself was just not nearly as fun. Too many gimmicks, not enough playing the video game. Too many gimmicks, not not enough uh, sassy. Gameplay just wasn't as fun. Not not as much. Not as much also, as... they like redesigned all the characters and made them ugly. They ruined Dub. I'm still bitter about how they redesigned Dub's character. Guys, I caught one speedy spirit out of the out of the seven we've seen. That's a lot of speedy spirits. There is. Tracer, chaser. Okay, I'm gonna mod my version of this game, so whenever I shoot a tracer, chaser, it just goes, Cheers, loves! Cheers, love! Come instead of going, Nyeow! Like, instead of making the car sound effect it makes, it just goes, Cheers, loves! Also, let me pop a door open. Pop. All right. I keep clocking on that stupid signpost that shouldn't have collision for any reason. All right. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and beat up Biff Atlas. Biff. Biff. Bitch. Don't forget to get that boo that walked in that room earlier. I got it already. I exited and came back to that mansion. A.K. I was a bitch. Because I was like, hey, wait, having to manually go through this whole place and not knowing if I'll do it all? Fuck that. <laughs> yeah, I Don't had a feeling I wasn't going to one cycle. I gotcha. <laughs> Why do I feel like after you said that, like the next line was going to be, whoop, sorry, Mickey. Like, that just felt like the, the progression of that at that time. Oh, 
Also, because I talk about my connections and not uh, too much already, let me go ahead and talk about my connections and, and what I know about this. So, um, apparently, Gerard's working on this particular version of Luigi's Mansion. Gerard? The completionist. Uh -oh. With it, you know, with all of its achievements in it and all that jazz now. And the fact that you have to get the perfect run to get the S new S rank mansion. Just, and yes, Gerard does work on everything. But I'm just saying, like, anybody who, anybody who was wondering if he's gonna do it, yeah, he's working on it. But Fuck. good chance, considering how rough this game is now, he won't be he won't get it out for like another month, unless he put it out like today as a bonus episode somehow. What the hell? I've never seen that happen before. I got a shield cell while I was in third place. Too bad it didn't help. Shield cell is the invincibility item, in case you were wondering. Okay. And he might have, I mean, he might have a small team that works on it, kind of completing multiple parts to make sure that he doesn't miss anything, but I wouldn't be surprised if he still plays most of the game himself and his team does most of the editing and fact checking, if anything. Wait, the completionist doesn't play all the games himself? Uh. Maybe I'd have nothing to back up, back up a tr the truth or the truth or lies behind that statement. Look, all I can tell you is that is that Yo Schiller, aka Bradley, he works he works on the show now as an editor, so I learn things from him. <laughs> oh yeah, I go. Do I go upstairs? Or do I go downstairs? All right, this is the part of the game where I'm just kind of like left to flounder in the air while I find Mario's goods. Water? Also, I'm going to leave the mansion and go heal. Is there a mirror in here? Yes, there is. Back here! I'm in first place! Shut up, Daisy. Shut up, Daisy. No one loves you. I fell off again. <laughs> I'm sorry. I should not laugh like that, but you just sound so dejected. I fell off again. I'm a little over this. <laughs> You know, I've gone past being mad, and it's more like, oh, this may as well happen now. It's because, like, the first, like, actual turn, you get out of a, you get out, like, the first actual turn, there's, like, a bit where the track sharply cuts to the left slightly, and if you are not far enough to the left, coming out of the tunnel, you just, like, clip into a little pit. Can I back up for a second there? Sharp left sh slightly. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. <laughs> like, it does, like, a hard zigzag. So, like, if you, like, hit, like, the left curve, you'll hit the right curve and kind of like that? Or... So, like, if you're far enough left, you can keep going straight. But if you aren't far enough left, then you fall into a hole. Okay. There, yeah. That's what it sounded like. I just, I wanted to A, double check, and B... Wanted to... It's hard. It's a especially because the detection hole or like you know the track around it is kind of questionable. Sometimes you'll like think you're okay and then you'll dink into it, which is dumb. Man, this stupid. My back tire keeps clipping the sign, so I bonk. I hate it. Why you got a bonk? You gotta bonk so much. I just don't understand why they gave those signs collision! Nope. You are not gonna touch- Nobody's touching me. Nobody's touching me until I give consent. Consent given. <laughs> oh shit.
Colorado's really hard. This game is not a cakewalk, by the way. Mickey Speedway USA truly is the Dark Souls kart racers. Oh god, why is there an el why is there a fire elemental ghost in or oh, ice element ghost in here? I don't have fire. Uh, have game's hard now, by the way. Just a gentle reminder. Dude, I've been saying it. Thanks, Blutcher. I'll have to come back to you, Mr. Ghost. Don't, don't worry, I got you. Oh. Put that that's... on my funeral. On, on my on my tombstone. On your funeral. I'll put it on your funeral. Don't put that on my funeral. <laughs> You're not invited to my funeral. Oh man, I've been dis I've been uninvited from the funeral. <laughs> one of my favorite uh one of my favorite uh comment chains is like a Just let it be known, if I ever die, you are invited to my... You, I expect you all to make my funeral the most bumping party ever. And then someone responds, if you die? And it's like, great. The only party I've ever been invited to, and they might not even die. <laughs> Alright, well... If? Closest source of fire. It's pizza. Okay, wouldn't that be like I don't know? I don't remember how the character. I don't know. Thanks, Farf. I'll follow that up in a second. But I don't know how the character layout works with the uh, cousins or the the trio in there. But like, wouldn't that be some shit if like you, cl you get the platinum on all this shit and you unlock Von Drake as a as a racer? I mean, I unlocked Von Drake. That's a thing you have to do. Oh. But that's not how. That's uh, Von fun. Drake is getting platinum in hard difficulty on all five cups. I have to redo this whole room. Unlucky. On two health now, by the way. Run, Luigi, run! Whoa! <laughs> Von Drake is the speed running character. I've had enough of your shit game. Mm. Oh, that hit. Okay. Thanks, game. I bet I haven't saved in forever, have I? Oh, no, I saved it with the boo. Uh, <laughs> game's hard, by the way. Sorry, Daisy. I thought we were friends. Nera, I'm not... The worst thing about playing is the nephews is that it removes Pete from the AI racers. Pete gets a, a nix from the AI? Yeah. You take his quote-unquote slot. Rude. Hello. Hello, Doc. Which is a shame. In a perfect world, it would remove Daisy because nobody likes her. But. But this is not a perfect world. But this is not a perfect world, exactly. <laughs> God, I hate. I hate. I love it. I hate. In a perfect world, men like me would not exist. This is not a perfect world. Oh, mm. uh, classic YouTube, never change. Motherfucker. <laughs> Door stuck. I love like being in first and then like overdoing a turn and immediately being in fourth. Um, the controls in the on the 
two DS, by the way, are a little are a little jank. Like DS, by the way. Like I can move up and down by with gyro controls, but like if you hold B, then you like move. Like if you're using both sticks at once for the GameCube version, it's a li it's a little jank, but it's not terrible. It does have a lot of auto tracking on it to help to help compensate for the lack of a second thumbstick for some pe for some consoles. Oh my god! How's that hole treating you? <clears throat> I've been falling down with a lot of cliffs today. Hmm. Thankfully, I have bites the dust. Bites the dust, though. Now, all right, do you get fire? No, you don't. Turn. Now I have to go back to another room with fire, get get fire to go back into the room with the ice, to... This game can do various terrible things. The funny thing is, you are uh, you playing this, and different. you said that. I'll be back and you later. Okay. Oh. No, you're not. You're not running away. You're not running away, mouse. I'm surprised I got that mouse to spawn again. Also, ceiling's gone. I think. That's the, that's the most like the sorry two thing. No, no slammy, no slam Alabama, no slam Alabama jamma dama. Why are you actually following me onto the ceiling? This is not cool. Don't worry, if it's disorienting for you, it is for me as well. Oh god! Run away! <laughs> oh, he's still alive, damn it. God. Please, no. Run! I got them both. I don't know how I got them both, but I got them both. What are we doing? What are we doing, dude? What is the song and dance we're doing? Are we done? Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god, help. Why are there two of you now? I hit them both. Screw you, game. Get your cutlery horse shit out of here. Mm -hmm. 
And I only get one of them. Nice. Even though I stun even though I charged up the strobe ball really hella hard. By the way, I just want to note that this room only had like two ghosts in it, and none of them were elemental. <sighs> yeah, that room only had two ghosts in it in the original. What the actual hell is wrong with this game? I refuse. Nera, I'm not. I. I it's. I can't lose to anime if there's no anime here. Luigi is not anime. At least I don't think he is. Give me this. He moved. Hi, Boojangles. Now you're going to stay right here, Mr. Boojangles. Right where I can see you. Shit. We'll come back for the ice element in a minute. No, that was my second try. I died. <laughs> First try. Nana, you have a boo in your room. I'm waiting for there to be achievement where you catch a boo in a dark room. Tell me he just went back over here. I don't want to have to leave the mansion. Oh, there he is. So, that was fun. The controls just froze up for me for half a second. <laughs> okay, look. I couldn't be that casual. I never would be able to be that casual with my grandmother. Just because the respect for her and all that, my, the respect I have for her and all that jazz. But I feel like if I ever did something like that, like, Grandma, there's a ghost in your room. Where? It's Grandpa. What? <laughs> Let's see, Ice Elemental, Chili Places, Refrigerators, yada yada. <laughs> that was horribly morbid for me, by the way. Because guess, cause guess what? My grandpa, both of my grandfathers have passed on. <laughs> Not my grandmother's, my grandfather's. <laughs> anyway, let me grab an icy boy. Hello, good boy. Oh, Ruby. I like rubies. This will be a daily wait for intensifies. They see you as small and helpless. They see you as just a child. Surprise the fire when they see the warrior is hidden deep inside. That's not the exact words, but you get it. I also stepped out of mouse trying to check chat. Chat, you're to blame for this. Ooh, went away from the bats. Hi, bats. All right, later, dude. Yes, it, yes, it was Nera. 
I'm at 60 health. I'm going to go fight Petunia first. Well. Oh. Miss Petunia, why is there a mushroom, a poisonous mushroom in your sink? Miss Petunia, what is your problem? Miss Petunia, a conversation if you will. Do you realize the ramifications you have of putting poisonous foods in the sink? <laughs> Show me. Hubba hubba, fuck that. Ah! I'm, I'm soaked. Get me away from that poisonous mushroom. <laughs> oh my god, it's seven? At least I got most of her rewards. <laughs> it's meant for children. Some, at least. Got a key. <sighs> Goddamn. What time is it? 10? Mm. Alright. It wants me to go back down the floor one. Um, I think what I'm actually going to do tonight is I'm going to... I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to capture Nana. And then that'll be... I'll probably that's where I'll cut off the stream and then I'll come back at this tomorrow but hey I, I hope I myself myself included I hope good night Gaia I hope everybody has enjoyed this this uh, experience of learning how terrifying uh, ter how terrifying Luigi's magic can actually be Nara, <laughs> Nara, are you going to make everything about every game I play somehow be something either somebody's a monster or somebody is sexually explicit? Next thing you're going to say, Luigi? Or you're going to say, Luigi caught sleeping with Nana? Scandalous! Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give Bad ball. I'm going to fight Nana at this much health without saving. Hey, you ever hear of a bad idea? This is one of them. Considering each of her, like, eye lasers do 20 health, holy crap! Christ on a bike. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Missed. Ah. Oh. God damn it. You know what? It might be a good idea just to go outside, heal up, and save. And we'll try again in a second. that if I do this fight with Nana and I get hit by four eye lasers or four knitting needles or whatever she's shooting at me, that's it. I'm dead. That's the fight with Nana over. So it's a good idea to save right now. And I really wish I could get all the way to Bulasis at, in this right now before I end things off, but that's going to take a long time. Area 3 is like areas 1 and 2 combined. 
And then Area 4 just kind of screams past as soon as you get through the blackout. Like, it actually screams. It passed you in the period, just going, ah! <laughs> Nara, this is not incentive for you to become a ghost so you can stare death needles at me every time I say something stupid. Nara, no. Nara, I know what you're thinking, and it's a bad idea. <laughs> I might have an issue. It's, it's called opening doors. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, great. Now I gotta dodge that while I get this stupid yarn ball. There we go, got it. Nana's got fight in her! Listen, old people have a lot more fight than you give them credit for. It's just they require the uh, shock of adrenaline to do it. Ugh, damn it, 41 health. Oh, Nana just gives up right away now. Grandma's been eating her Wheaties. <laughs> oh, I can go to the twins room. Lovely. Limbooger, you were going to stay either in this room or go over to the weight room. Where did he go? <laughs> Grandma's been hard on life. Cereal. I think he went in this room. I can't get in unless I go all the way around the mansion. Oh, Christ. So anyway, while I take my time to chase down this last boo, does anybody have any questions I want to ask before I end off the stream? Also, I said earlier, but I don't think a lot of people were here for it. I hope you guys, I mean, I know this is pretty basic, but I hope you guys kind of like this 3DS template for 3D, for the, for these kind of games. We won't see it too often, but I feel like it's nice-ish. I have to reset it. Damn it. <sighs> Nara, listen. It's a bad idea. Because then you're going to be stuck haunting me. And if you're stuck haunting me, you realize some of the dumb shit you're going to have to subject yourself to daily because you haunt me? Then what happens when I die? Well, we're going to be haunting each other, torment each other with the stupid shit we say. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bad idea. Back. Well, you're back. I came back and I was like, I'm back. Wait, I deafened myself. Click. I'm back. Good job. So I'm gonna, I'm getting, I'm getting this ghost in Nana's room, and I'm probably gonna fi finish things up unless we decide to play something else for a little bit. 
none of the other goons are around, so I don't know what else we could play other than 1v1s and Lethal League plays. I mean, we could do 1v1s and Lethal League plays. Yeah. We could do it for like half an hour or so. That's if you're up to it. I just got back from eat men. Really nice. There's a really good ramen shop near where we live that we always order from. It's really nice. I like it a lot. Well, I hope you like it a lot, otherwise you wouldn't eat that that much. <laughs> Ramen is good. If you get the real stuff, yes, it's good. <laughs> if you're out here going Maruchan's the best ramen ever, get the fuck out. <laughs> uh. Anyway, so I did it. Do you wanna? I guess chat, like quick, like half hour stint of Lethal League Blaze, or you got you good here? Lethal League 420 Blaze it. Where the fuck is the home button? There it is. The 2DS home button is kind of receded on this thing. Oh, God. Like, I'm going to hold it up to the camera. That's the home button. It's kind of not even a real button. <laughs> it's like pseudo touchpad. 2DS, by the way. Good budget 3DS system. It's clunky. 2DS XL is, like, really good, though, isn't it? Yeah, apparently that's really good. Like, if I didn't already have a 3DS XL, I would get a 2DS XL. Because, you know, it's like no one cares about the 3D feature. True. I've thought about if I upgrade if I upgrade from this 2DS to something, I would actually upgrade to, um... I would upgrade to 2DS XL for recording purposes. I mean, I've still got this 3DS this new 3DS XL over here, so. <sighs> Alright. Yeah, screw it. We'll Donald pushed me off a cliff! Oh, you're not. Alright. I cool. was gonna win, too! Fuck you, Donald! <laughs> Alright. Actually, I think I'll, uh, I'll just end it off here, because I'm gonna... Drown, I'm going to drown my frustration sorrows from the Hidden Mansion in Dragalia Lost for the next hour or so. You're going to get lost in the sauce, dude? Dude, that sauce. I'm lost in it. Alright. Well, hey, thanks for everybody coming out. Um, if Man. things... Okay. If things go good tomorrow at work and I don't stay home for one reason or another, I don't even know if I would. I... I feel like I just started getting a scratchy throat, so I don't know if I'm getting sick like I usually do around my birthday or not. But if things go well, if things go well, we'll pick Raid of On this again tomorrow night. Maybe even finish the game tomorrow night, and I'll have like a buttload of footage to throw up for what the Hidden Mansion all entails. It'll be great. I've still got a chance. What chance? You threw it away. I don't have a chance anymore. <laughs> anyway. I did throw away my chance. Unbelievable. Get a load of this guy. Having chances and throwing them away. Why is he even here? Why is he even playing games? He's not a gamer. Anyway. You folks have a good night. And I'll try my best to see you tomorrow.